Like two boys. Two boys. One brain cell. One brain cell. My name's Chuck. I'm Joel. And today we're checking out some propaganda. Propaganda. This one is Potemkin City Limits. You're going to repeat after me now? <laughs> Say that again. Potemkin City Limits. Potemkin. Potemkin. I'm not going to I'm not going to say that the rest of the reaction just so you're aware because I'm not going to remember that. <laughs> and I'm going to stumble over that word every single time. I know you are. Especially I immediately today. just look back up. I'm like, I don't I want to say pot immediately like Potemkin. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> right horrible. before the video, he's like Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> it does. Every time I see it, I've heard this requested so many times. And every time I think Pokemon, it's horrible. Um, uh, let's jump in. Shout out to Lost Motel for the pick. He's been destroying it this month with, uh -huh. with these propaganda and picks. He even gave us a game to play with it. I know, which we've utterly destroyed. <laughs> we've already <played laughs> we are it. so off. We decided to put a spin on it where we can only use each guess once. And we're screwed. And we have to do it right after each song. Yeah. And we've already failed. Yes. It's been, <laughs> been rough. So let's send it, bud. Let's do it.
Well, what would you say that one's about, bud? I don't want to talk about it. No, I know. When I, when I hear Francis, I immediately just think of St. Francis. I don't know why. Really? Yeah. What do you think of? Ajax? Ajax. Yeah. Deadpool. <laughs> oh, I was like, are we talking? Francis. I was like, are we talking about Greek mythology right now? I'm like, no. wow, I should have figured. I got all excited. <laughs> I'm like, we're about to have a deep conversation. Sweet. <laughs> No, no, Chuck's no, like no. Deadpool. I saw a movie once. <laughs> Son of a bitch. It doesn't happen often. And Francis always loses. Yeah, I was getting religious vibes from this one a little bit as well. Just a little bit. Really? You want to see where? Yeah. Not the beginning there, but not just some fractured fairy tale. Although I wish that that were true. This fable is far too real, yet we somehow cling to. And then St. Francis in my head. It all <laughs> okay. makes sense, dog. Okay. No, it doesn't. Hey, jeez, my goodness. Hey, you be nice, dude. That's they're, a they're erecting him in gold? Yeah. What am I missing here? Why are you looking at me like I'm a moron? Explain it to me. Break it down for Francis me. Francis is a deer. And there's a bronze statue of him as he leaves the city. <laughs> Where the hell did you get deer at, bro? Holy shit, I didn't catch that As he's laying there in a pool of his own blood. Okay, so a guy can't lay there in his own blood? You know what I mean? But no, you're 100% right now that you're saying this. <laughs> Yeah. The panic grew as humans stalked among them. Mm hmm. So this is an anti hunting song. Yes. The city limits are safe for deer. Okay. He didn't make it, though. Nope. I see. Damn. This is like a more fucked up version of Bambi. I very clearly know what this song is about now, but I can't guess it. I'm so upset. Hmm? Why not? That's the one I chose for the last one. <laughs> that was my burner pick. <laughs> it's well, the next song. Well, I get to vote that correctly, and I'm still going to miss it because I was just like in daydreaming land, like, man, Francis, that's a definitely like reminds me of St. Francis. <laughs> the, the fact that they gave him a, the deer name is what really messed me up, though. Well, they were trying to make it, you know. More human-like. Yeah, humanize it. Mm-hmm. Kind of like so that, you can see what the like real the, issue is. Kind of like that one uh, modest mouse video did. Yep. Yep. Hmm. Intriguing. Good. Uh, first of all, I got to give you credit here. Yep. Because the verses really confuse the hell out of me. I'm like, I'm enjoying the story, but I know it's always about something very specific, mm -hmm. and I missed that part in the beginning. So completely was like, oh, yeah, that'll I'm like, you. I have no clue what's happening right now. Um, I but, caught that right away. And I'm like, oh, but this, this part with the, not the factor, uh, fractured fairy tale. Immediately. I was like, when I heard that, I was like, is he taking a shot of religion right now? Shit. I would pick that one. <laughs> <laughs> you thought we were both screwed? <laughs> I didn't know you were screwed at the time, but I knew I was screwed. Oh yeah. Cause you had yeah. that too. Yeah. Yeah. My head is not on today, dude. It's this. so bad. Dude, when we got to that part, I'm like, it's not just some fractured fairy tale. Like, you know, Bambi. Not once did I think animal. Really? Not even once. Well, now I feel bad because I gave it away and I didn't. You could have got this wrong too. Thank you, Chuck. <laughs> Instead, I gave you a right answer. I appreciate that. I definitely would have got this wrong, 100%. I was, like, combing through my head, like, what would this line up with? Because I completely missed that part in the beginning. I was distracted with the complete peaks and valleys of this song instrumentally. Like, it went up and down. It, it, I love that. Like, little pauses here and there to give it, like, a little bit of air. Oh, my God. Like it's a very solid song. I was definitely distracted with that, but that's no excuse. That's hilarious. I'm I'm impressed with you, bud. Yeah, and I'm sure. I never would have got that because I missed that right there, the humans line. 
Yep. And I'm sure it's written on my face the second I realized it. No, you were laughing about the puddle of blood. And I was like, what the hell is he talking about? I was laughing at myself. Because you realized what it was? Yeah. Yeah. I was wondering why you were laughing. I'm like, why the hell is he laughing about this? Why? No, I was laughing at myself. Because at that point I knew that I fucked up. Mm-hmm. Hmm. So this one goes after hunting, and this is kind of humanizing that, as you put it, as yeah. well. Intriguing. You know, weirdly, I'm more for hunting than I am for the meat industry. Okay. I mean, yeah. You know what I mean? Um, But I think with the bronze statue, they're I, symbolizing I, trophy hunting. Oh, and trophy man. hunting's a massive issue. And, that's bad. <laughs> Even most hunters don't like trophy hunters, dude. Yeah. Damn. So, let's jump into ratings here. And I'm going to go with a 7.2 and add this to a playlist. 8.2 playlist. I Bang. really I really enjoyed. Um, first of all, the instrumental for this was fantastic. I was like, I don't even know what the song's about, but I was loving the absolute depth there lyrically. Yeah. Like I was a kid in a candy store. I'm like, I had all, so many different thought processes of what this could be about. Not one of them was correct. And I love that. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it makes me look like a fool. That's all good. But <laughs> damn, dude, I love when a song does that. Yeah. And then absolutely. like at, over several listens, I'm like, no, it's about this. Or like, I'll be like, it'll hit me just different one day. And I'll be like, no, it's about this. <laughs> I love that. My personal favorite is when you're listening to the song and you it hits you what it actually is. And you're like, wow, I'm an idiot. <laughs> yeah. Because you were so far off. Way far off. Happens a lot. Well, I was just being more, the, with the religious thing, I was legitly just being humorous with the St. Francis line. Yeah. There was no way that just the chorus was going to be completely religious out of right. the rest of the song. Right. Like, that made no sense with the, because at the, at the end, I was like, okay, well, maybe with the statue, that might be a lineup with it. But the rest, like them talking about the city limits and stuff, I was like, none of that makes any sense to me with that whole idea. Yeah. So I was like, going to mess with you and try to, yeah, dissuade you a little bit, but you already knew what was going on. I could tell yeah. the way you were looking at me. And I'm like, okay. I was sitting there. You want to like, break this down to me? Because uh, clearly where, I'm a moron. Where are you going here? I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know. I might as well just start throwing some stuff out. You know what I mean? Do yeah. do what you do best normally, but <laughs> yeah. you nailed this. Respect. Respect. You want to bring up the list so I can make my... Next burner pick? My next burner pick. So um, I'm going to pick... Killing animals is bad. Hey, at least one of us gets this right. Um, I I'm going to pick the rich and power elite are bad. Yeah, you missed that somewhere in there, I imagine. Well, we got two more left. Yep. We got music is good and eating meat is bad. That should be an easy differential. <laughs> Unless it's the rich and power elite are bad somewhere. <laughs> and then we're just like, ah. Oh. It's going to be real easy to know if we're wrong with the last two. Listen, I'm so torn with propaganda reactions right now because, one, they, they sound so good in your playlist. They do. They sound so good. But, God damn, do I feel so stupid, dude. <laughs> stupid. Yeah, I, I know the feeling. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, you're like, this is normally how I feel. You deserve this. That's <laughs> like, <laughs> and now oh. there's an F-bomb to rate right at the beginning of the song. Hell, yeah. And I'm going to give that one a nine. Hell yeah. It's going to get a nine because the pop wasn't as high as I wanted it, but the placement was mint. Mm -hmm. And uh, I vote for you to get the brain cell in, in this one for sure. Again, because I respect it. That was good. You caught one line and you uh, wrapped it all up very nicely with a little bow on it for me. <laughs> Got you. Yeah. I, <laughs> that's what friends are for. Though he would have used that against me in a heartbeat if he wouldn't have, if he would have thought ahead of himself a little bit. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. So I'll be nice to you in return for your niceness. Appreciate it. But normally, you know well, what I mean? How you know? I know. <laughs> how I know. <laughs> okay. We're going to move on to the next thing, guys. We appreciate you. Shout out to Lost Motel. Have a wonderful night. Peace out. Are you okay? <laughs>